Hello and welcome to another dream about anything video. Another summer has passed and I still don't have a refrigerator in the workshop, but I will solve this problem as well, better later than never. With this I will always have something refreshing to drink, but of course first I have to transform it into the style of dream about anything. I found and bought this refrigerator from the Facebook market. The first thing I will do is check that everything is in working order. Now that I've got it all set up, it is time to clean it up and get it ready for a makeover. To be honest, I was looking for a smaller one, only this type was available, so I bought one. Inside, I plan to put all my energy drinks on display, like true YouTubers do. Luckily for me, I have enough space in the workshop even for a such a large showcase. I take the display case apart so I can work on each part individually. I thought at first of painting it all at once, but that's for the lazy people. We, the dreamers, don't do it that way. And you, if you want to become part of our big family, you can do it by subscribing to the channel and activating the bell. This way you will help us develop the channel together and move headlong forward. Thank you for your support dreamers. Now let me continue with the video. I prepared the individual parts for painting. I have to tape over absolutely everything that I don't want to clean from the paint afterward. As a protective masking I will use the classic material newspaper. For the younger dreamers I will explain that the newspaper is like an internet news site printed on paper. Here I will use cardboard so that I can cover the entire opening on the display case. I also need to cover the compressor, it will be difficult to clean it of paint. The inside look very good so I won't be making any changes there. And here I just filling in the holes. Apparently I have a lot free time to waste. To get a good base for painting I will use a plastic primer first. Wait a minute crash, what are you doing, the walls are still covered with foil. I know dreamers, I just decided to experiment, whether the primer and the paint will stick well on such surface. If it doesn't turn it out right, I will fix it, that's ok. Hmm, that's why I didn't become a basketball player. After the primer dries, I continue with the base color, which will be matte black. A little selfie for a memory with the old showcase. Other secondary colors I have chosen are neon and I expect them to have a very cool effect. It's time to prepare for the more serious painting and as always, safety comes first. Today I'm going to use a non-standard method, maybe somewhere in the vast internet you come across it. Several paints are used in this method. Of course, the colors don't matter, I personally prefer the neon ones. I paint in strippers with all the colors. Then I wait for them to dry. I will apply the same procedure to the display case. The key component in this method is dishwashing liquid. Let me explain what it does for me. I apply it in lines along the details. I apply the lines as I see fit. To finish I again apply the main color on top. A matte black. Here's what it ends up being. I 
I have extra work with the case because I have to lay it down. Otherwise, there is a small problem caused by the phenomenon called gravity, causing the dishwashing liquid to fall down in surface. The downside is that I have to wait for each side to dry separately. But as I said in the beginning, apparently I have too much time to waste. While I wait for the side to dry, I will wash one of the details to see what happens. It's unique and I expect to be even better under neon light. I also wash the remaining details and start with the other side on the display case. I didn't want to move the whole thing, so I decided to wash it in place with the hole. Maybe it wasn't a very good idea. I like how the display case turned out, but something seems to be missing. Of course, the Dream About Anything logo is what is missing. I will make this showcase our promotional product. Ready, this is now an official Dream About Anything display fridge. I decided to stencil one on the back as well. After everything is dry, it's time to apply a protective vernish. After all, the workshop will not be the most hospitable place for a refrigerator display case. I'm done with the vernish, all that's left now is to assemble the parts. The assembly was easy, just screwing in a few bolts. All that has left has to clean it to shine and fill it with drinks. Here's another use for the newspaper. It does a great job of cleaning windows. All that's left to do is mount the shelf. It seems that I'm a little tense and excited about the upcoming good ending of the project. Here is the final result, I hope you liked the idea and we try to paint something with this method. I was crushed from dream about anything and if you like this video please give it a like. This is how you help me and my channel. Thank you for watching, see you again in the next video. And I will get busy stocking my cool showcase with everything a real YouTuber needs. Bye.